It is slow and it's ugly. It doesn't shoot enemy planes from the sky. Even its own Air Force doubted its abilities. But after more than 25 years of service, the A-10 Thunderbolt is still one of the most dependable and deadliest aircraft flying. Also known as the Warthog, the A-10 was designed in the 1970s to provide close air support for troops on the ground. It wreaks havoc on the enemy with an array of potent weapons at its disposal, including the largest gun ever put into a fighter aircraft. Serving in conflicts such as the 1991 Gulf War, Bosnia, Afghanistan, and Iraq, the A-10 silenced critics and endeared itself to the many coalition forces it protected on the ground. its 30-millimeter seven-barrel Avenger cannon, the destruction from its shells, and the sight of its hulking figure have made the Warthog one of the most feared aircraft in the world. It's a very feared weapon system. Uh, prisoners of war that were captured in Desert Storm and uh, the most recent conflict uh, have said that the A-10 and the B-52 were the most feared weapons on the, on the battlefield. Uh, the A-10 in particular because it could stay for so long it was like a vulture to them. The appearance of an A-10 is a welcome sight to friendly troops on the ground. We're about the only airplane in the Air Force that we directly support the Army. I mean, we actually go out and we talk to that guy on the ground and I mean, we're, we're like an infantryman in the air when it comes to helping him out. I mean, whatever he needs, we do it for him. Uh, like I say, we directly support the ground on the ground. Though the A-10 has received several upgrades since it first rolled off the factory floor in 1975, it still remains a rather simple aircraft, capable of fulfilling its mission. Everybody likes CF-16s and F-15s fly over, uh, and uh, our motto is go ugly early. Uh, bring an A-10 in if you want the job done. After more than 25 years, the A-10 has truly earned its reputation as one of the world's deadliest aircraft.